first when someone comes to me or like I want to look good in the mirror I always ask them why like what is what's the deeper reason behind mm -hmm. that because I feel like there's something more there just yeah. to look good in the mirror has was never motivation for me to change and I'm pretty sure that's why the whole diet industry exists right because mm -hmm. we're we're chasing that, that external validation I guess if you would um instead of like something a little bit more of an emotional connection yes. um, because our external appearance is going to change when we age, right? It's just a matter of life and mm -hmm. aging. Um, so if we're only chasing that, it's like, well, there's more to life, right? So I love that you said that when a client comes to you and says, I just want to look good in the mirror, that the first question you ask them is what's that about? Like, why do you want to look good in the mirror? And yeah. that is why I feel so excited about working with you on this workshop is because that's exactly my approach with my clients as well is looking at like what else is going on. Yeah. Um, and I just think that that's so important because we can so easily get sucked into this belief that once we look good or in a certain way or good according to somebody that our other problems are going to disappear or that finally we'll be happy with ourselves or, oh, I'll finally feel confident once I look a certain way. Mm -hmm. But I always challenge my clients to check out and say like, okay, so when you did get to whatever that number on the scale was or on the days that you felt like, yeah, okay, I like what I'm looking back at me. I like what is looking back at me. Was there an internal shift too? Mm -hmm. Because if there wasn't, then when you get to that weight that you think you're supposed to feel good at, you're going to need to keep going because unless you're doing that internal work as well and doing that deeper exploration into what's going on beneath, then no matter what that number on the scale says, or no matter what is looking back at you in the mirror, it's never going to be enough. Mm -hmm. Going back to worthiness, right? Yes, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. But applying mindfulness to like our body and our emotions and our food while we're eating can really deepen our awareness and help us to create a healthy relationship with our body image and food. I agree. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's um, going to be a beautiful workshop. It is. I'm so excited. <laughs> <laughs> our next workshop is coming up on March 13th and it's a two part workshop. Um, the second part is happening in April. And in this workshop, we're going to be talking about how you can empower your body through mindful eating. We're going to be teaching you what mindful eating is and how to use it. We're going to be helping you to understand how mindful eating can actually start transforming your relationship with your body and food. And we're going to be supporting you to understand how applying mindfulness to your body, emotions, and the process as you deepen your awareness around food. We're also going to be talking about what the difference is between hunger in the body, heart, and mind. And we're going to be talking about how to fuel yourself with specific foods and nutrients that your body actually needs to satisfy that physical hunger in a healthy and nourishing way that's going to make you feel good about yourself and your body. And um, we're also going to be talking about how to satisfy the hunger in your heart and mind without using food, which never fulfills that hunger anyways. That was quite a mouthful, but is there anything that I'm missing there, Jenna, from what we're going to be talking about in the workshop? I don't think so. It's, it's going to be jam-packed. It so. is going to be jam-packed, and I'm yeah. so excited to be working with you on this. So yeah. if anyone wants to find out more information, you can check out um, either of our social media pages. Mine is at The Essence of You Counseling, and Jenna's is at Simply Nurtured. Simply Nurtured, yep. And you can also find out more details on our workshop at www.theessenceofyou.ca and just look for the heading Empower Your Body um, and let a, either of us know if you have any questions. And if you want to get in touch with Jenna, um, I'll just let you say where people can find you. Uh, you can find me at simplynurture.ca or on I'm most active, active on Instagram at Simply Nurtured. So you can just send me a DM there and I will get back to any questions that you have. Awesome. Great. Thanks so much for joining me today, Jenna. And yeah, yeah looking forward to seeing everyone at the workshop. Okay. <laughs>